Bible lesson today, Alessio, is about Father Abraham. Have we been singing a song lately about Father Abraham? We have. Well, I'm going to talk to you about Father Abraham and his wife, Sarah, and they, Isaac. They, they, Isaac. Want, they wanted to have a baby. You already know this story. Okay, I'm just going to go home then since you already know it. <laughs> So before we get started, I always like to give you a little something to get you to that Bible story. Is it hard waiting? Yeah. Is it really hard waiting? Yeah. yeah. Really hard waiting? Yeah. yeah. Is, it, is it hard to wait for Christmas? Yeah. yeah. And Halloween too. And Halloween too. And Halloween too. How about our birthdays? Yeah. Is it hard to wait for our birthdays? I'm happy yeah. my birthday clock. How about when we have to wait to take our turns waiting online for the swing on the playground? Yeah. Is that hard to oh, wait? Yeah. It is. Well, there's a story, a true story in the Bible about Abraham. Okay. Here's Abraham. And here's his wife, Sarah. And God made him a promise. You want to know what that promise was? Yeah. God promised Abraham and Sarah that they would have many, many, many. Here's a big word you're going to learn today. What? This says descendants. Can you say descendants? Yeah. Do you know what that word means? Yeah. No. Oh. Can I tell you what it means? Yeah. It means that you have a mommy, right? And mommy has a mommy, right? Yeah. And you have a mommy and a grandma. And then they had a family. And then they had a family. And then they had a family. And they had a family. They had a family. <laughs> this week, Miss Marie has been talking to you about families, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, we're going to put Abraham and Sarah over yeah. here for a little while. Cool. Okay. They're going to come back and say hello later. Because I have another part of my story right here. Along with that promise, friends, I have something to show you. God promised them that not only would they have a son, but they would have as many descendants as there are stars in the sky at night. As many as there are stars. And as much as there is sand on the beaches. Is that a lot? Yeah. So I'm going to get this open. There it is. I'm going to pour some in my shell here. Can you count this as I'm pouring it? One. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What about one little sand there? Can you see the one? Yeah. God told Abraham and Sarah that they were going to have as many children, as many yeah. descendants as there is sand on the ocean, on the beach. And I'm going to turn the light off because I want to show you my stars. There was a lot of stars, like a lot of descendants that God promised. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, here comes the stars. Ooh, there we go. And that was God's promise. But do you know what? Sarah was very old. She was older than me. A lot older than me. And so was Abraham. And they were like, how can we have a baby? We're way too old. I could be a grandma and I could not have a baby. But that's God's promise. God promised to give them a son. And this is how it started. One day, one day, Abraham was sitting out by his tent. He's already sitting right here by his tent. Okay, he's over here by the tree. Because it was a very hot day. It was too hot in the tent. It was like today. It was very, very, very hot. And then all of a sudden, he saw some people, some men, walking down. What? what? And it's I'm going to move this over here. Give me a little more room. Hey. So he was sitting out by the tent, and it was very, very hot. Yeah. And what do we like to drink when it's hot out? Water. water. So this is Abraham. He saw him and he decided, say, hi, how are you, friends? Would you like something cool to drink? And they said, yes, we would. It's very hot out there. So they decided to go sit down 
and they were going to have a cool drink of water. And then Abraham said to who? Who is this? Sarah. 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 She was in the tent. Go get some bread and make them some bread and get them some water to wash their feet because they didn't have shoes on and their feet get very dirty. So that's what she did. She went inside of the tent and she decided to make them some food. So she went in and she made it and then, then she came out with the food and she brought it and they sat down and they had some bread and they had something to drink. And then the men said, do you know what, Sarah? And she was back over here by the tent. She said, God said that you're going to have a baby in about a year from now. She laughed. She was, are you serious? I cannot have a baby. I'm too old. So the men went away. They walked away. And then what happened was... About a year later, guess what happened? What? What? Here comes Abraham, and he's very, 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 very happy to find out that they had a baby. And who was that baby? Jonah. Uh, the baby was, you Jonah. said before, Isaac. 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 And here's baby Isaac. Let's see if I can get her to rock baby Isaac because he was probably crying. But they I had to know. wait a long, long time because she was about 90 years old. She was kind of old. And Abraham was 100. Can you believe that? Yeah. They had to wait a very long time. I forgot to show you. I have my toaster here. I'm going to make some toast because I'm hungry right now. It's almost lunchtime. I'm going to put it in here, and we're going to wait. I'm going to put the toaster down. I'm going to wait. Are you hungry? Yeah. Are you hungry? Yeah. I wonder when it's going to pop up. I'm still waiting. I don't think it's ever going to happen. But you know what? It's like God promised Abraham and Sarah that they were going to have a baby, and... They waited, and it came up in the toaster, right? The toast came up out of the toaster, and God kept his promise. My mommy? Yeah. My mom is the only one that I did. Can we pray about that? Yeah. Okay, guys. Dear God, Dear God. Dear God. we thank you so much for keeping your promises. We know that you put a promise in the sky when we see a rainbow. And we love, we love you so much and for taking such good care of us always. And we give you all praise, honor, and glory. It is in Jesus' name we pray. And all of your children said, Amen. Okay.